going to be seen back on the stage. Well, after two months of um, smelling garbage, it's a great sensation being back on the stage. Um, from now, I can smell beautiful perfume that all the girls wear, and it's definitely a better smell than garbage. Yeah, it's great being on the stage again. How's your fitness? Well, since I've been here in Perth, I've been cycling and swimming and running, and um, the fitness is pretty good at the moment. Yeah, not too bad. Dancing always keeps me quite fit as well. So, pretty fit. I, I don't know about whether I can qualify for the All Blacks or not, but... Now, has doing the rubbish round helped? I'd say, yeah, because it's given me um, something to get up early in the morning and get out there running on the streets, you know, lifting lifting the garbage and stuff, and um, it certainly keeps your, your legs fat, you know, running all day, and also for your stamina, and um, yeah, it's a great job for keeping fit. Um, I couldn't think of anything better to do when I'm not dancing is to do something like that, because it really does keep you very fit. Why aren't you dancing for time? Well, uh, I decided to go back to my hometown uh, to settle down because I wanted to be around my family. Who, you know, after dancing 11 or 12 years, uh, I sort of missed them after a while. So I wanted to go back to my hometown where I can be around them. And um, the odd occasion I get a job which takes me overseas, and I don't mind mixing dancing work with um, other interests. You know, for me, dancing is not really my whole life. You know, it's just a part of it. I think there's more to life than just dancing, you know. So, um, I was dancing full time for you know, about 10 or so years, and admittedly, you get tired of the lifestyle, you know. Uh, the same working late, getting up late, and you know, it can be a bit of a health hazard sometimes. So, I think to mix different jobs is, uh, is good for me. Are your fellow dancers surprised at what you do for a day job? Um, well, actually being a dancer, when you're not dancing, it doesn't matter what you do. Sometimes you're waiting, sometimes you're working behind the bar, sometimes you're collecting garbage, you know. And I, I think um, most dancers accept that you have your periods of working, uh, doing different contracts, and there's always a, a dull period where you're not working. So, you know, I don't think they're so surprised that I'm doing that, you know. Um, you take the good with the bad. Thank you very much. You're welcome.